fingerprints still on my skin. Backseat taxi sinking in. Ice cold window rain. Eyes closed, wet clothes, let it in Heard your laugh on my TV Pass your car on every street Sean, one of my favorite things about you is that everyone who meets you loves you instantly. I think I've probably loved you since we first became friends, more than 15 years ago, before I even knew what love was. I love how I can be myself around you and your family. I love how you remember all the little things, and I love laughing with you. I love how amazing you treat me. I love all the Spotify playlists we make. <laughs> I love how much fun we have together. You make me happier than I ever thought I could be. When I was 12, my mom left me a letter. In that letter, she wrote, love is easy to fall into as long as you love yourself. At the time, I didn't understand what that meant. But now, standing in front of you on our wedding day, I know the love we share is exactly the kind of love my mom and dad hoped that I would one day find. You make me feel brave and capable of anything. You make me feel strong. You make me feel like the prettiest girl in every room. I am today. So. <laughs> <laughs> Abba, <Abba>. <laughs> you make me feel proud and confident in picking you as my forever teammate. And you make me feel deserving of the kind of love you have given me. The kind of love that everybody dreams of finding. Sean, you truly are my best friend and the most caring, hilarious, smart, and genuine person I have ever met. I can't believe how lucky I am that I get to be your wife and proudly call you my husband. You're the person I want standing in my corner, by my side, for the rest of my life. And I promise you, no matter what life throws at us, that I will always be standing in your corner too. I love you. Thank you. I don't know how I'm gonna top that. <laughs> Catherine, when I first met you, we were struggling to get through math classes together and talking to each other on MSN until the sun came up. I like that you share the same energy of me as me, whether it's watching movies all day, hanging out with my or your friends, having fires outside, random walks in the park, or even watching whales in the Hawaii sun. <laughs> Regardless, I'm just happy to be on any adventure with you by my side. Catherine, I promise you my heart, that our future together will hold many, many more moments of laughter, dancing, adventure, and relaxation. Even though MSN doesn't exist anymore, I think it's safe to say we can still keep each other up late with our strongly bonded connection and banter. And instead of struggling at math together, we just have to struggle at learning how to buy a house together. <laughs> we can do it though. And I look forward to raising a family with you by my side. I love you, Catherine. Sean and Catherine, we have heard you promise to share your lives in marriage. We have recognized and respect the covenant of marriage you have made here before every single one of us here as witnesses. Therefore, in the honesty and sincerity of what you have said and what you've done here today, it is my absolute honor today to henceforth declare you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. It is my absolute pleasure to be the first to publicly introduce with bubbles, with bubbles in the background, that was a little hint, Sean and Catherine Moore as husband and wife. Woo!
afternoon. <clears throat> I'm not so beautiful today. And always, but especially today, Laura and Leo, we thank you. Yes. Catherine, I would like to mention both your parents because back in the day, growing up in Rossport, I knew them quite well. Laura's be beauty radiates through you, your sisters and Grant. And as for your dad, we always know and feel the presence of Leo's humor through you every day. <laughs> I know that both your parents would be so very proud of you today and very happy. We wanted to thank them both for bringing up a smart, kind, and funny as hell of a young woman that you are today. It's definitely a beautiful testament, the impact that they have had on you, and it's clear that their spirit lives on. I'm so proud of you for the woman that you have become, and I look so forward to seeing you to grow more with the journey you and Sean are on. Sean is one of the most kind and caring persons I have ever met, and it's an honor that you are marrying my sister. I know that mom and dad would feel the same way as I do. They'll always be in our hearts, and I know that you will be watching over you, eh, Sean. Congratulations, and, and, I, and I love you both. I remember Kath first telling me about Sean in my basement, and the light in her eyes when she spoke about him was something I never saw before. Help me. <laughs> Um, she had that sparkle. I have witnessed Kath express many different emotions throughout our friendship, but the one that she that expresses the most is happiness ever since Sean came into her life. I know that this love that we see in front of us tonight is real, it's raw, and it's perfect. It honestly is spectacular, and it's been an honor to watch it unfold. When I think of a love story, I instantly think of Kath and Sean. All jokes aside, I do want to say to you, Kath, um, that you fit into our family like a missing puzzle piece. Um, your laughter fills our, our homes with so much joy. I know that you've always been a huge part of Sean's life, even when, you're, when your relationship was just a friendship in high school. You two have finally found each other after years and years of just being friends and I hope that you don't ever let that go. I am over the moon that Sean has found someone just as amazing as him, and even funnier than him. And I know that wherever life leads you, you guys are gonna be safe and happy together. So with that, everyone raise your glass to the happy couple and uh, my brother and my sister. Yeah. Love you guys. <laughs> Been the prince, I've been the pauper, been the star.